right buddy. Stuff. That's a good one there. Boy, look how healthy that thing looks now. Wow. You know, it's midsummer right now, and Al and I are going to focus on looking at the Carolina rig. Carolina rig is actually a really old uh, method to fish uh, bass. Realistically, a Carolina rig is very, very similar to what a lot of walleye fishermen use in the North Country uh, for deep water walleye fishing. But there's a little bit of an art to uh, catching fish on the Carolina rig, and hopefully we're gonna catch a whole bunch of big ones. There you go, oh, look at that guy there. There's another one, fish. Jim. Oh, feels big. Man, are they, uh, here she comes. Ooh. This is what I what I like. This is what, what what summertime deep water bass fishing is all about, ain't it? I think yours is well a little bit bigger than mine, but it ain't bad. Yeah. Yeah, you get out on these deep water humps. Yeah, you, you know, at this time of the year, and you can really whack some of the biggest fish in the entire lake. Look at how fat that fish is. You look at that that hummingbird, and you can see there's a bunch of bluegills out here. You can feel them chugging. Uh, on this thing, you know, it's really, really uh, a fun way to whack a man. Woo! You know, there's a wide variety of different uh, baits to uh, fish on a Carolina rig. Right now it's midsummer, so what I'm doing is throwing a great big worm. This is a, a Trigger X hammer worm, 10 inch worm. One of the classic baits that's probably one of the, the real uh, key bait for catching them on Carolina rigs is a lizard, a six inch lizard. I think Al's using the big mo. So right now we're in midsummer and we're in a little bit warmer water. So we're using a little bit bigger profile baits. Those last two fish actually came out of about 12, 14 foot of water. Okay. We have to get back up. I sort of blew off that spot a little bit. There's sort of a rock spine that sticks off a big weed bed out here. A lot of guys use lizards, uh, uh, lizards for Carolina rigging. Stick worms work really well, you know, you know, for an ultra finesse bite. And you could play with a variety of different kind of baits. Got him? Oh, big bass, Al. Oh, that's a big one. Wow. That sucker just nailed it. That's a big he one there. Oh, he's coming up and then he, he decided to go down again. Wow. That felt like a good one there. Oh, 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 oh look at that oh, guy oh. there. <laughs> that, that one's got some, what do they say, shoulders? Yeah, that's a whopper there. That's a big bass. Look at the size of that guy there. Whoa. Oh, look at that guy there. I'm serious. Boy, that's a big, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. Oh, come here, buddy. Boy, he's just rooting. I'm telling you, Al, this guy here is a tough one. It's a big he, fish. And he man. should be. He should be. That's a big, big one. He should actually almost drop a GPS coordinate on this spot to see if he's got some buddies. Deep. <laughs> it's just bigger than I it's thought it was. Bass. No wow. question. But it's wow. a big, big boy. Look at that guy there. Ooh, look at that. No question about it. As you can see, Carolina rigging produces big bass, and it's not only in the summer, spring, summer, and fall. It's a big bass technique, no question about it. Look at that gorgeous fish.